James Gallo in the Golden West Trailer and Equipment Broadcast booth running through a 3-2 Warrior win over the Memorial Cup hosting Kamloops Blazers. We head downstairs where we're joined by Warriors assistant coach Gord Burnett for the Man Greek Coaches Show. Uh, Gord, where does this one rank for the Warriors here tonight? So I described it as hard pocket for 60 minutes of play. Yeah, that's a good way to describe it. It was a good hockey game. Um, a little bit of a t- territorial game early. A lot of uh, forecheck dump it in for check it in on the puck hard and um you know, i thought we did a pretty good job getting out of our own end when we uh even under a heavy pressure so yeah, that was uh that was a good test for us uh, that's a good hockey team and, and they're i'm sure they're even going to get better but um I, i'd say mostly a territorial game early and then i think the special teams essentially dictated uh, the rest of the game and yeah, talk about the special teams first the penalty kill board for the warriors as it came up pretty big in the first period of play, especially an abbreviated five-on-three for Kamloops, but still, the penalty kill came up when the Warriors needed it to come up big. Yeah, absolutely. The uh, you know that's a good power play. I think they're third in the league, twenty-eight uh, percent. You know, to kill four of them, one of them uh, five-on-three. That's a good job by our guys, especially. Uh, you know, we give up the we give up the goal in Prince George, which which hurt. We didn't like at all because we knew that was that was coming there and um so to respond against a real good power play uh, tonight and kill four in a row and then he, even late the guys uh six on five with the goalie pulled situation a uh, great job there too and you know we didn't ice any pucks there which was nice and, you know to um to be able to chip it out and even almost get one with the eggs on the blue line uh diving up for that puck but um i thought we did a good job in, in that situation as well and then on the power play, the Warriors go two for four against a very good penalty kill for the Kamloops Blazers, including the Warriors' first five-on-three power play goal this year. Uh, good puck movement. Uh, Gord, just talk about the success and the man advantage. Yeah, it was, you know, anytime you get uh, two goals in the power play, that's uh, going to help you out. Um, you know, they, they try and hit Ferky on the plunger early in the five-on-three. It doesn't work out, and then then I believe it's Ferk, and then Corsi sneaks in back door there, and, and uh, I believe it's Ferky that uh, makes a real nice pass to, uh, to Corsak short stick there on the back door. So, um, you know, that's nice to see. I'm sure it feels good for the guys. I think that's uh, Corsak's first power play goal since he's been back. Um, so I'm sure he's happy about that. And, um, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's a game. The special teams are so important. It's, I guess, why they call them special teams. And, and I thought uh, all the guys involved uh, in those areas did a great job tonight. I think it's worth mentioning your goaltender tonight too. Connor Unger was Jeez. was pretty good for four years. Wow. <laughs> Connor made thirty six saves uh, here this evening. Some pretty clutch saves. Think about the the power play chances that Kamloops had in the first, but you know the third period with their with the net empty, the extra attacker. Your goaltender boy, uh, if you wanted a bounce back game for the Wednesday nights in Prince George, he did it here tonight. Yeah, some of those saves were incredible. The, the, the chances, the pucks laying there. You know, he gave us a chance to clear them. They got a couple whacks on the side, and he gets that leg out late. And geez, some of those saves were incredible. And you know, he's been like that all year. You know, I know in Prince George, he liked to have some of those back, but uh, it's a it's a great, great, great sixty minutes for him. Those saves at the side of the net were incredible. So. Big boost for this team. Get the first win on the road trip against the hard team, and then get ready for the Kelowna Rockets tomorrow. Yeah, absolutely. It's uh, enjoy this for a little bit, and then uh, get our bodies and minds right for tomorrow uh, against Kelowna. So. Um, it is a big win. I think, you know, if it wouldn't have gone this way, it might have been set us up for a tougher road trip. So I think uh, we're feeling good about it. Um, and, you know, to beat a team like this uh, in, in this type of tight game with the feel that it had, and I guess you could, some might say, is a little, little bit of a playoff feel to it, but real tight check. And I, I, uh, I think it's a big, uh, big win for us and a big uh, win for our confidence too. Magri Coaches Show, the assistant coach, Gord Burnett. Congratulations on the victory tonight, Gord. Good luck tomorrow night against the Kelowna Rockets. Thanks, James. I appreciate it.